Turn it on. And the Uncle Dutch Harley B. Kent Jackson uh, came from the uh, standard speaker to uh, do a little piece on my, my bikes. He felt as though it was interesting. And what else was your interest? Was the 49cc safety? Yeah, I wanted to find out what you have to do to ride them legally. And I just liked the idea of them because I'd seen them around town for the first time this year. And I thought it's a good hybrid for people who might want to pedal sometimes but can't pedal all the time or get up some of the hills. But the legal issue was the gray area yeah. that you know that you're going to yeah. cover and write the story on yeah. because of the, you know, the, the facts are what colluded at at, at best. Yeah, I wanted to get get us some answers. I'm, I figured from your experience, you would know the, practically what what the do's and don'ts are with the. And I and, and I stated I, I I tell people all the time. What did I say, Ken? About if you, if they tell you don't ride it here or whatever, don't be a pain in the butt. Yeah. So I mean, it's nice when the media takes an interest and especially the legalities because. Somebody can get hurt. The pedal assist laws say 49cc is legal without a license or even a driver's license. But it's like anything else. If you're drunk or you're disorderly, you, you have something to answer to, right? Correct? And the newspaper's right enough on that. Right. So what we're going to do is I just wanted to go do my YouTube piece. Kent, and let's show them this for a minute. Rusty, the, uh, Rusty, the GMC Jimmy's coming along. Uh, the doors should be done today. And I, the story's not about him. Kent came a long way. Rusty's big diesel brother just landed here. The military K5 uh, original with the extended cab. Uh, very rare bird indeed. And I got to show that to Kent. Because Kent asked me about that truck. And he had never seen one that was broken in half as bad as what some of these trucks are. And uh, that's part of my legacy. Is I, There was nothing else I would rather be doing on a on a summer day than, than out, you know, working on something and reconstructing it. So that's my uh, peeve. Ken, thank you for the considerations. Great to meet you, Dutch. All right, great to meet you too.